A very minor miracle just happened. As many people are not aware, the Japanese openly shun American vehicles. In fact, they openly shun vehicles from any country that aren't made in Japan. This is just part of the Japanese culture, and it's something that not many people are aware of. But when you look at the sales of cars in Japan, they are extremely dominated by Japanese automakers, Toyota, Honda, Mitsubishi, Nissan, Suzuki, Subaru, for example. It's very difficult for foreign automakers to sell cars in Japan because the Japanese shun them. So, when I heard this news, to be honest, I was shocked, very shocked. And in fact, I still am shocked. It's almost incredibly difficult to believe. As reported by Yahoo Finance, Tesla sales climbed 1,300% in Japan as Gigafactory Shanghai allowed more efficient deliveries. Now, sorry guys, but sales haven't dramatically gone through the roof in Japan solely because Giga Shanghai allowed more efficient deliveries. They've gone through the roof in Japan because I think something else is starting to happen in that country. They're starting to accept the fact Tesla makes the best electric vehicles. Something has changed. Obviously, this doesn't just come down to more availability of cars. It also comes down to a cultural shift happening in the country. So, the article reports, Japan is the fourth largest auto market and Tesla Inc. has historically had a hard time selling vehicles in the country. Tesla and every other foreign automaker, by the way. The Model S and Model X are too big for many of the parking structures in Japan, which require cars of a certain size to fit into movable parking spaces that help with the country's limited space. The Model 3 solved this by being just the right size, but prices were high due to shipping from California. That's not entirely true. Remember, who makes vans? Who loves vans? The Japanese. How big is a van? Generally bigger or a similar size to a Model X or Model S. I'm not convinced in the veracity of this reporting so far. But things are starting to change. In a story shared by Teslarati, Tesla sold 1,300% more vehicles in March 2021 compared to the same month last year. 44 units sold in March 2020 versus 588 in 2021. 44 versus 588. That is an enormous difference. I think, and I suspect, as these 588 Tesla vehicles are driven around, and remember that's not for a very long period of time that those were purchased, so by the end of the year we may be looking at 10,000 potentially. I suspect that as those Tesla vehicles are driving around, they will pique the interest of other buyers, and the buyers who have purchased those cars will be telling their friends about them. Now, obviously, we know Tesla's strategy for marketing is word of mouth. Tesla does not spend money, like every other automaker in the world, on marketing, at least not on the kind of marketing that we're used to, uh, whether that be TV advertisements or paid placements of ads. Tesla doesn't do that. They are very, very intelligent with their marketing, and clearly it's working so far. Other car makers should be paying attention, in my opinion. So, why has this happened? It was due to multiple factors, but the main trigger was Gigafactory Shanghai, says the report. This is Tesla's factory in China producing the Model 3 and the Model Y. These vehicles are being sold mainly in China, but some are exported for delivery to Europe, Australia, and Japan. Earlier in March, Tesla lowered prices of the Model 3 in Japan due to lower shipping costs. The standard range Model 3 price was reduced by 17%, while the long range variant saw a decrease of 25%. There is currently a backlog of orders in Japan for the Model 3. Another another factor is Japan's EV subsidies. The subsidies have increased this year, meaning buyers can save even more buying an electric vehicle. That's great to hear. Fantastic to hear the Japanese government is getting on board with the new electric future that we're all looking at. Whether that future happens sooner or later really comes down to a series of factors, including how well governments really get on board and support electric vehicle companies. And it's good to hear that the Japanese government is doing that, unlike the Australian government here who oppose electric vehicles and are doing nothing other than taxing them. Australia, get your shit together. It's not good enough. Guys, I'm excited to hear 
Japanese are buying more Tesla cars. It does sound like part of the reason is because of the prices reducing. That's good news. And in fact, I think that's only going to continue as Tesla makes their manufacturing processes more efficient as they bring out the 4680 battery cell, as they bring down the cost of prices. They're going to continue to do this. When Tesla bring out the $25,000 small electric vehicle, that will sell in Asia and particularly in Japan incredibly well. I believe Tesla's demand will be through the roof for that vehicle in Japan. Guys, I hope you've enjoyed the article. Have a great day. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.